Hey guys, wanted to give a um, update about what's been going on with my lap band. Um, he, uh, we went in last week and did the upper GI because I'd had a really bad um, night and uh, with a lot of fever and um, a lot of heartburn and um, a lot of weakness and all that so I called his office and the girl had originally told me that I couldn't have it done until like the 30th or 31st I can't remember um, but come to find out he was at the hospital doing them so went in and had that done it um, my band has slipped a little and um, he couldn't say for definite if there was any band erosion he saw a, he said that he saw an area that concerned him, is what he said. Um, when we initially started talking about band erosion, he said that none of the patients that he had put the lap band in had ever had an eroded band. But, he said that there was a first time for everything and erosion would totally make sense for why I've been having all the problems. But the day of the upper GI, he was not willing to say that I had any band erosion. Um, I went in and saw him today, and we are going to go ahead and take the band out. Um, he said that he felt like that was the safest thing to do. Being that the band has slipped, we could reposition it. Um, but he doesn't want to do that. I'm not, I don't think I'm at the point where I want to do that. Um, so we're just going to go ahead and take it out. So my band removal date will be May the 23rd. Um, I will not be having a revision done for a couple reasons, but the main reason is uh, weight loss surgery is not covered under my insurance. And even though he wouldn't charge me for the revision, um, I would still have to pay for the hospital stay, and I can't afford that, so um, I'm not going to have a revision done. I'm going to have to buckle down and do this on my own, um, which scares me because I kind of feel like if I had done it on my own, if I could, if I could do it on my own, then, then we would have already done it, but um, the band, you know, the my weight loss with the band has been pretty good. So, I'm happy about that. Um, so, we'll see where we go from here. It's um, It's been a long journey. And the scary part is, is that we're not even 100% sure that the band is what's causing all the problems. As far as the uh, fevers and body aches and painful joints. Um, but because there is some slippage which really, any slippage is bad, but this is not like a significant slip in the band. Um, so we'll just go from there and see what happens. But I'll keep you guys updated on um, the removal and anything else that I find out. Talk to you guys later. Bye.